So for terms of the series, uh, we'll get back to storyline on either Friday or this weekend whenever we decide to do the actual uh, free agency and draft and everything else. For purposes of progressing the series, the next two episodes are going to be a combination of the next four games each and then the last four games of the season. Um, We're going to do highlights, basically play the moments, show you uh, two games worth of highlights, and then just sim the other two games and show you stats. But other than that, that's what you get to look forward to over the next two episodes. So today which is going to be Monday when this drops, and then again on Wednesday. All right, so we're going to drop back here with Nix. I'm hoping he's a lot better than Tubbs, but he's a 73 overall, so I... Yeah, well, I mean, we it's DJ Quick, so I mean, we'll make touchdowns with DJ, definitely. He's going to be a huge standout with, for the rest of the season. All right, we're going to try it. We never use this play. I'm trying to switch it up for you guys, keep it interesting. Let's see if it works. Nope. And there goes our first pick with Bo Nix, our replacement for Tubbs. Wow, big shocker. All right, we got the ball back. Drop back. Boom. Holy shit, I wasn't even throwing it. He hit him so hard, it just popped the fuck out. Okay, we got it back again. Let's see what this does. Boom. Oh, there's our second interception of the game with Mr. Nix. This is going to be fun. All right, let's get back here. Can we at least score another? Nope, we can't even score another touchdown. We're just going to get hit left, right, and center. Great. Okay, let's try our cheese play. At least our cheese play should be able to work right here, right? Yes, it does. Oh my god, he's got two guys on him, and he still drags him into the end zone. Look at that. Touchdown, DJ Quick. Second one of the game. Let's go. Okay, let's see if we can keep this close. We got the two-point conversion last time. Here we go. Bink. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Oh, he's off. He's off to the races. He's down. He's going. Touchdown, baby. We just closed the gap. We're going to take one point. We'll close it to eight points. All right. So we got the stop last time. Here we are, fourth and ten. We have to get... Nope. And that right there, guys, is the game. So... Let's take a look at this. Bo Nix, 45% completions. He has over 300 yards. That's decent. Three touchdowns. We did come back at the end, but four interceptions, guys. Four interceptions. And for a 73 overall, I can accept that. That is fine with me. Anthony McFarlane closes in on 1,000 yards. DJ Quick has a game for the ages. 11 catches, 238, 3 touchdowns, 21.6 average. Only one sack allowed. The other one was actually my fault. Uh, let's see here. Guyton. Guyton did not get his sacks or his tackles for loss or his interceptions. So he does not get his superstar development going up to an X-Factor. We're going to have to try to play out of our minds in the next two games in Sim to see if he gets it. So, okay. So in this game right here, Bo Nix goes 335, one for one, 63% completion rating. That is a lot better than his last game. 86.9 overall, which I think he was a 45 last time. 10 for 39 for Anthony, so he does not hit 1,000 yards. We need about 50 yards. No, about 40 yards more to get it. No one went over 100 yards here. No one got multiple touchdowns because we only threw one. But, I mean, still, one sack, only one sack allowed in this game, guys. That is a lot better than last time. Fred Davis showing out with 10 total tackles. Anderson, like always, 10 total tackles. Guyton, one more time, just does not show up. So hopefully, hopefully he made enough of an impact to where we can get a development. 
Okay, so third game overall against the Redskins. We got the win in this one by five points. Only by five points. It shows 225 yards, which Haskins did better than us. We got 70% completion, four touchdowns to only one interception. Doing a lot better, finally getting a win, even though that's going to propel us. Um, I still think we need to go for the first overall pick as close as we can get. 21 for 145 and a touchdown for McFarland. He goes over 1,000 yards rushing finally. 7 for 89, no touchdowns for him though, but Schwartz, Benson, Trevino, and Offord all get a receiving touchdown. No sacks allowed. Guyton got four sacks, guys. I don't know if I left it in here or not. Probably not, just to keep it cut for time. But we did get a developmental uh, scenario for him again. So I'm hoping that four-sack game right there is going to be enough to get him his X-Factor. And it was. He got his X-Factor, guys. He went from a superstar development on a shitty team and got unstoppable force. This guy is definitely sticking around on our team. He's going to be a building block for our defense from here going forward. So into the last game, another divisional matchup. Come on, DJ. And DJ gets hurt. Our one shining star in our receiving core just got hurt. Talk about shitting the bed. Okay, he's going to come back into the game. That's good at least. All right, second and goal. Let's see. See, I'm not so mad about Knicks because Knicks is a shitty quarterback. All right, let's try this again. It's 14-7. Let's see if we can tie it up right here. And we're going to go to quick. We're definitely going quick. Watch this. Bam! Touchdown. I'm surprised he didn't throw it, like, way off to the right. But, hey, whatever. It's tied up. All right. They went down and scored. Now it's 21-14. Can we get another score? This should be easy. Here we go. Bam! Anthony Schwartz into the end zone. Man, he shows up when I need him to. All right. Let's cheese him again. We got to get this play right here. We got to get this play. Bink. All right, we're inside, inside the, nope, not inside the red zone. I thought we were going to get in the red zone right there. We're five yards out of the red zone. Here we go. Second and ten. We're going to take this right here, right there. No! No! We had a chance to win, or at least tie, but we had a chance. No! And because of... A deflected pass to no fault of Bo Nix. I will not hold that against him. We just lost to the New Orleans Saints. A team that had the same record as we did. They came in here 4-8 and eight, or 4-7. and seven. We came in here 4-7. and seven. They're going to leave 5-7. and seven. We're going to leave 4-8. and eight. But still, like most games, we are overdoing it in passing yards. So, I mean, at least Bo's going to have decent yardage going into next episode. But it is really, really tough to deal with this, honestly, guys. 351, three touchdowns. So, we tied Tua as far as passing touchdowns. He did better on the completion percentage. We did better in yardage. He had a better quarterback rating. But, I mean... That last interception, I really don't even want to count it. I don't even want to go there. Uh, McFarland, 19 for 77, four yards of carry. He's already over 1,000 yards. I think that's going to put him over 1,100 yards. Uh, Schwartz had over 100. Quick had over 100. So I, know, I think Quick is now at like 1,250 or 1,300 yards. No sacks. 14 for Anderson, 12 for Lockhart, uh, one interception by Eubanks, one uh, sack by Clinton Guyton after he had his dev scenario increased to an X factor. Um, we have a lot of positives, but there are a lot of negatives. So that is it, guys. That is the 
first four games of the remainder of the season. Wednesday, we are going to have the last four games of the season. Um, and it doesn't look like we have any divisional matchups. So I'm thinking we're probably going to showcase the first game, which is going to be the Ravens, and then the last game, which is going to be the Bears. After that, um, I want you guys to leave down in the comments what you guys want to do. Do you guys want to do a live stream for free agency and the draft, or do you want me to record it and then just do one big long video to show you guys what we came up with and mix some storyline in there? With that being said, guys, remember, hit a like on the video, show your support for the channel. Remember, if you have not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, keep up on all the action, and I will catch you guys next time.